Aloha everybody, it's Connor at uh, Kona Free Divers. I'm here with the Trident Spear Fisherman float. Uh, this is kind of the uh, quintessential float for your spear fishing needs. It's gonna mark your spot. It comes with a uh, 12 by 12 flag, which is uh, the legal size. You gotta have it 12 by 12 uh, or bigger uh, or else DLNR can and will find you. Um, it's got an internal bladder a zipper that you can, you can access it through. It actually fills up the whole entire uh, case, which is kind of cool. Some of them are a little bit uh, smaller inside, so they don't fill up the case. Adds a lot more drag. This is, uh, fills up pretty good, so there's not a lot of drag on the surface. It's got a cool little spot down here. You can put soft lead, you can put hard lead, something to ballast your float. That way it keeps the flag upright and you're not showing the fish that you're diving. Uh, and then it comes with these two tuna clips, which is something that a lot of other floats do not. The cool thing with this, they got the swivels on them. It's quick release, so you can clip up to your tagline, you can clip up to your uh, gun, you can clip up pretty much anything you wanna hang from it, you can clip to it. Uh, and yeah, this float's great. You, you're gonna need one to be able to keep your fish on it because if uh, the tax man comes and wanna take your fish, uh, you wanna be quite a ways away from him when he does. So usually I run like a 50 or 75 foot uh, bungee line to it or a flow line. Uh, and then yeah, you can throw your uh, your uh, cooey on it. And yeah, it's a good float. If you get tired, you can rest on it. And for the price, it's a really good float. I think it runs 44, so it pretty much comes with everything you need for the float. So yeah, if you want one, come on down to uh, Kona Free Divers, check them out. And we've got a couple other ones too, if this one doesn't suit your needs. So yeah, come on down, check us out. Right on guys, have a good one.